Khan San Pagoda reflects Vietnamese soul. The Khan San relic site in Chilin district, Hai Duong province is closely associated with many well-known Vietnamese figures such as Tran Nhu Yen An, Q Ian Quang, and Nhu Yen Trai, a national hero and world cultural figure. The highlight of the relic site is Khan San Pagoda, which reflects Vietnam's historical, cultural and religious value. Khan San Pagoda, also known as Han Pagoda, is located at the foot of Khan San Mountain. It was built in the 10th century and was expanded in the 13th century during the Tran Dynasty. The pagoda consists of a front hall, an incense offering hall, an upper hall and an ancestor worshipping hall. The upper hall worships Buddha and has a 3-meter Buddha statue. In the ancestor worshipping hall, there are statues dedicated to King Monk Tran Han Tong, Venerable Monk Fat Lone, second founder of Truk Lam Zen sect and his successor Hu Ian Quang, high-ranking Mandarin Tran Nhu Yan Dan and national hero Nhu Yan Trai. Le Dewey Man, deputy head of the Khan San Keep Back Relic Site Management Board, says Khan San is one of the three centers of the Truk Lam Zen sect. In 1329, Venerable Monk Fat Lone, the second founder of the Truk Lam Zen sect upgraded the pagoda. His successor, Q Ian Quang, expanded the pagoda, taught Buddhism, printed Buddhist sutras, cast Buddhist statues and developed Khan San into one of the three principal centers of Buddhist Truk Lam Zen school. Khan San Pagoda embodies the royal architectural style distinguished by a half-moon lake and a three-door temple gate at the front. A path aligned with ancient pine and lychee trees leads to the bell tower before reaching the main sanctuary. The three-door gate is decorated with modified patterns of flowers and clouds in the architectural style of the La Dynasty. The pagoda features a traditional sculptural style honoring the four sacred animals, the dragon, unicorn, tortoise and phoenix, and the four sacred plants, the apricot, pine, chrysanthemum, and bamboo. There are also sculptures of other animals like the crab, fish, and deer. All animals bow before the Buddha, showing that all species and people are equal and are educated by Buddha to become good. Mr. Manikane, Khan San Keep Back Relic Site is preserving several valuable artifacts and antiques including four stone steels dating back to the 13th century behind the pagoda. One of them was a gift King Tran Du Tong presented to Mandarin Tran Nhu Yen Dan in 1369. The stele is of special cultural and religious significance. In 2015, it was recognized as a national treasure. Khan San Pagoda receives thousands of visitors a year. Lathi Kwayan is a tourist from Hanoi, we visit the Khan San Keep Back Relic Site every year. The landscape here is tranquil and peaceful, helping us relieve our tiredness. We also bring our kids here to learn about Vietnam's tradition, culture and history. There are two annual festivals held at Khan San Pagoda. The Spring Festival takes place from the 16th to 23rd of the lunar January to commemorate the anniversary of the death of Venerable Monk Hu Ian Quang. The festival includes many rituals, a water procession, a worshipping ceremony, a prayer ceremony, wrestling, human chess, and Quang Ho folk singing. The Autumn Festival is held from the 16th to 20th of the 8th lunar month to mark the death anniversary of national hero Nhu Yan Trai. Participants take part in ceremonial singing, requiems, lantern festival, swimming and wrestling competitions.